Greetings, what is good, Divine Alchemist Collective? I hope that you are all doing well. My name is Iris, I am the Womb Alchemist, and um, I thought that I would do a really fun, uh, well I think it's really fun, but a fun video where I ask Spirit, um, what does your current counterpart okay boyfriend girlfriend husband wife whatever situationship but what is the the person that you're currently dealing with okay on a romantic level what do they think about you okay this is for femmes for masculines okay um so it doesn't matter what gender you are but we're going to be asking spirit what they think about you okay at this time so yeah let's get into the reading i've never done this kind of reading i kind of just obey um and accept what spirit wants to tell me in the moment uh but we are going to see here okay what does the current well okay this came out what does the current what is the collective's current partner okay romantic partner think of them here okay the ten of swords kind of came out all right uh for some of you <laughs> for some of you someone might be thinking of ending their relationship here or uh, this could be a message for people who have already ended their relationship here okay well i'm getting for a lot of you all right this is what i'm getting because we got the we got the two of cups to the uh, temperance to the um, star card here. What I'm getting for a lot of you is that um, there's there a lot of you are in relationships that are karmic, okay? That honestly need y'all are in some toxic shit, okay? For some of you, and uh, deep down inside, you know that you need to get out of whatever situation that you're in okay because it hasn't been serving you this person has might be betraying you behind your back and you might have some type of intuition you might have some knowing here that this person is being untrue to you deceitful i don't know what type of betrayal it is okay it could be just talking behind your back talking dirty about you behind your back all the way up to cheating on you or you know planning something against you i i don't know or even just using you somebody who's not really in love with you but just using you for your your resources okay I, i'm not sure um we can ask but um what i get with this two of cups temperance of the star is that a lot of you need to focus on healing rather than relationships here because uh when you heal is when god can really bliss you with a, a true divine um, counterpart who is going to be true to you who's going to be balanced who's going to bring you peace and real love okay so the person that you're currently with right now is probably not the one that is meant for you with the seven of pentacles at the bottom okay you need to invest in yourself right now instead of wanting to be in a relationship so bad that you're willing to put up with anything and everything okay um, because you you really you're not meant for that and you don't deserve that okay you have a lot of star potential here you're somebody who works very hard okay and um, you're putting in the work but whoever you're dealing with here with the two of pentacles is not putting in the same amount of work here okay this person could be juggling you all right this person could be dealing with a, a third a third party or just just being deceitful, all right? Um, Eight of Pentacles here though, but you need to work on yourself, work on balancing your energy here because this person is, the, the trauma, the betrayal that you have endured here. The, um, the trauma and the betrayal that you have endured here potentially for a long time okay um is is affecting you 
okay it's effect it's, it's traumatizing you it's triggering you potentially all right but you need to be you need to exhibit this king of swords energy here the king of swords doesn't let anybody lie to them doesn't let anybody steal uh disrespect them okay the, the king of swords here demands respect here and if you don't respect him or her okay because you could you could be a feminine who needs to be in this king of swords energy here but the king of swords cuts people off no explanation needed all right so that's what spirit is asking you to do if you know that your partner is no good for you you just need to move forward all right yeah it's hard yeah you love this person yeah blah 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 all of that right but um this person has been doing you dirty for a really long time you've endured a lot for a really long time um but your patience your patience and you working on yourself you healing yourself you rediscovering who you are and balancing your energy that's gonna pay off big time okay gonna pay off big time a lot of you are in relationships where there's a lot of chaos a lot of fighting disrespect okay a lot of nagging yelling uh lack of communication here a lot of uh you know an inability to control your emotions okay uh you know cheating like lack of sexual discipline uh incompatibility um oof. shit the energy is just crazy here a lot of you are just in relationship just to be in some damn relationship that's what i'm getting yeah queen of wands here um queen of wands to the king of cups here okay what i'm getting is that you are you are a uh like the ultimate package here okay because the queen of wands fell on the king of swords you are the ultimate package here you're kind emotionally intelligent loving nurturing okay really positive i'm getting that you have a very positive outlook on life here very attractive Bold, confident here okay um but you're settling for less for some reason you guys are the full package but you're settling for less here um if you're a divine masculine watching this this could be specific for a, a certain person but there's a divine masculine here okay who's in this king of cups energy for this queen of wands you find somebody very attractive and loving but this queen of wands could be um i'm just gonna say she she could be engaged with this king of swords here all right she could be uh cheating on you or uh maybe there's a throuple where the 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 woman is in the middle and then she has two male partners okay um you could be somebody who's in a throuple where it's you and two ma two masculines um or vice versa but i'm getting like some poly action here you might be in a polygamous relationship um maybe you feel like you feel like in this polygamous relationship there's somebody who's being valued over you or this queen of wands loves somebody else a little bit more than they love you okay or someone is being respected more than you are being respected but that's specifically if you're in a poly relationship you might feel like it's really one-sided and it's not fair you might feel like you're left out um well you don't deserve that okay um But yeah, and then and then for somebody else, there could be um, a feminine here who is cheating on a masculine or vice versa. You might be a feminine um, and you have a masculine cheating on you. Uh, take it as it resonates here, okay? Um, but but what is it that? Let's see what the betrayal is. What what is this ten of swords here? What's the betrayal? What's the betrayal here? that the collective needs to be aware about what is the betrayal here the magician to the knight of wands somebody's doing spell work on somebody 
all right i'm getting oh god i'm getting somebody is putting menstrual blood and somebody's somebody's doing something nasty to somebody's food or uh yeah i feel like a cycle something to do with somebody's period okay i don't know if they're putting it in your food oh god they're dumping it in your food or your yeah i see it it's here okay um he says <laughs> you might be pissed <laughs> when you figure it out but uh somebody's definitely throwing spell work doing work on you okay to keep you around to keep you in love with them here yeah to uh i feel like it's somebody that you're married to okay with the empress here <sighs> yeah it's so that you'll look at them as the empress it's so that you'll you'll be aroused so that you'll want to have sex with them um that you'll find her very attractive here okay uh, she might have been, she or he might have, well, obviously it's a she, but she might have been doing this for a while here now, okay? But this is your opportunity to, um, to kind of do some investigating, some watching, pay attention, okay? Yeah, you, you need to watch this person here with the Six of Wands, okay? Because... Not only are they doing it, uh, this is somebody who likes to be seen, who likes a lot of attention, who likes to keep up with the Joneses, who wants the latest and greatest of everything. Okay, this is somebody who's very flashy, um, you know, uh, somebody likes ri ripped jeans and red shoes, all right, maybe even cheetah print here, uh, but somebody is definitely really like flashy. Okay, and you need to watch this person, okay, because this person, um, you know, is doing it for financial gain. Okay, you might be somebody who's, who is very financially stable here, and they're doing it in order for you to stay interested in them so they can keep uh, getting money off of you, okay? Yeah, um, it will be revealed to you in due time, okay, with the sun card here. Uh, you guys might even have a child together. You might have two children together. But um, it's uh, two of swords here. There's a reason that God allowed this situation to happen here. You have a lesson to learn, a decision to make. Okay, but this person is keeping you confused for as long as possible so that they could feed off of you. This person is an energy vampire. This person is a moocher, a gold digger, uh, whatever the case may be. Um, you guys might be high school sweethearts or might have had a child in the past, okay? But you guys started this relationship a while ago. You guys have been together for a minute. Um, but she might have trapped you with a child here, okay? She might use the child to get what she wants from you, out of you, even if you're, whether you're still with her or not, she might be using a child, um, yeah, to get what she wants from you here. Um, she's somebody who likes to party, celebrate a lot here. But um, justice will be brought to this situation, okay? Everything will be revealed to you. But this person is doing work over you, is using magic, uh, spell work, or whatever to get what they want from you, okay? To live this lifestyle of just like partying, lounging, relaxing, maybe even like doing drugs doing things that she or he doesn't need to be doing drinking a lot okay that's what i'm getting this person is a drinker all right especially socially this person likes to drink a lot uh yeah this person is definitely doing something behind your back to keep you um you know confused or under this illusion here so that you can stay giving her stuff okay this person might be uh she might like be forcing you to work not that you don't want to work but like every chance that she, that she can get you to work like work overtime or do this start this opportunity do that okay this person likes to push you towards getting more money okay um but this person is definitely has de definitely has secrets 
okay, that they keep from you. Uh, they might even be doing moon magic. All right, uh, there's an entity attachment here. All right, seven of swords, very deceitful. They lie to you. They, um, you know, they, they're, they're very deceitful, strategic. They do stuff behind your back, okay? This person might be planning on leaving you soon, trying to get what they can out of you. That's why they trapped you with a child. This person might be planning on leaving you in order to get your money, okay? So you need to be very strategic and put things in place. I don't know if you can do like a prenup or something after the fact, after you've gotten married. I think you can like do a prenup anytime during the marriage, but you need to do something to make sure that this person um, doesn't get what they want out of you here. Literally, okay, plan ahead of time, two of wands. You need to plan and take action on that plan because this person is planning on leaving you just to get money out of you, okay? This person is wanting to betray you here, all right? Uh, four of wands here this person's main focus is stability okay you guys are in a contract here all right and because you're in the contract she's he or she is going to act uh very innocent very forgiving but she's going to use your child here with the page of cups to um get stability in her life okay that's her plan his or her plan okay they're gonna they're using using the child as a pawn here um to get stability out of your out of this situation here okay um tower to the uh, queen of cups here this person is playing as if they are uh you know kind even shy maybe um but they're, they're she's acting like she's loving but really on the inside she wants everything to go wrong for you she wants your life to crumble she doesn't really love you she doesn't really care for you because her main focus is stability here <sighs> yeah queen of swords here okay to the hierophant god is watching over you and god wants you to put boundaries up here um not like don't lose control over your emotions but god does want you to um know that you're you are protected and you do need to be logical about it be smart about it be tactful about it your spirit guide has your back okay but you also need to be watching um and using your your you know faculties up here in order to um you know because this is a reading you don't know if any of this is true right but you have to watch this person just know that this is that first of all i'm speaking the truth here okay but in order for you to see if this situation is your situation you have to watch this person be very observant okay um that's what this hierophant is be very present okay um, when you're around this person, uh, observe this person when they're preparing your food, how they act, how they, uh, you know, because people do stuff when they really love you. You can tell when somebody really loves you. And I feel like um, you are somebody who kind of already knows, but this is just validation here. All right. But uh, you're, you're genuinely protected, right? In this situation, God has your back. Your spirit team has your back here. Okay. But just do your part. All right, this person is causing, causing, this landed on the five of wands here. This person is using magic to cause chaos in your life here, okay, to isolate you. This person is using magic to isolate you so that they can abuse you and get their wishes fulfilled, okay? This person might be um, trying to keep you away from friends and family who actually care about you, who are actually giving you good advice, but this person causes chaos and conflict, starts fights, okay? Um, puts stuff in your mind, in your ear, whispers in your ear, and getting like pillow talk about people, okay? Um, when you guys are in bed and stuff, this person might bring up uh, people who you care about or actually care about you and talk shit about them, okay? But this person wants a brand new beginning here without you, all right? This person wants to be single, all right? But they want your money here with the Nine of Cups, okay? They want your money to be stable, all right? This brand new beginning. 
page of wands to the ten of pentacles this person will never ever be able to touch your resources here okay this person is too naive to i'm like the s word is coming to mind too stupid all right this person is is definitely not capable doesn't have the um whatever it takes to take this away from you okay they don't have they can't come up against you and your spirit team they don't have what it takes all right so your fortune is yours but definitely this person is like the gold digger type here okay very immature this person uh they're not they don't have a good ability to think about things all right they think that this stupid plan is going to work here but um they're not spiritually strong enough uh physically mentally any of that to in order uh to get what is rightfully yours here okay yeah eight of cups this person is secretly wanting to move on okay but it's definitely hard for them there's some obstacles in their way keeping them um from being able to move on with your money okay and that's on purpose because the spirit spirit is um watching over you here Okay, they're, they're going to make it really hard. They're whipping this person's ass. All right, they're making it very hard for this magic to work. Um, for them to get access to your uh, fortune, to your money. Okay. One last thing before I end the video. Okay, the fool here. I feel like maintaining your energy here. Okay, making sure that your energy and vibration is high is really important. Okay, it's going to help your spirit guides, your spirit team be able to give you the information that you need. This is obviously this is not good news here, right? This is like such a burden to hear about the person that you thought loved you, cared about you, um, the person that you're sleeping with at night and stuff to learn that this person is actually wanting to hurt you and betray you it, it really sucks but you need to do something to keep your vibration high and stay focused here okay make sure that you are staying in 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 good spirits here okay so that when spirit tells you when you get that intuitive nudge okay to do something that you that you're able to receive it loud and clear okay and that you can make your move okay because spirit is going to guide you through this situation all right, but keeping your um, vibrations high is very important during this time, okay? And like I said, just be very observant here. Keep very strong boundaries, okay? Keep yourself guarded. Keep very strong boundaries. Hold your ground, okay? Do what you need to do strategically, you know, open up a trust, get a lawyer. I don't know, but you have to listen to your own spirit team and figure out what it is that they want you to do here, okay? Uh, but for now, they want you to be very guided so that you can receive, I mean, guided, guarded, okay? Guard your heart, guard your, your mental health, your everything, okay? Um, I'm getting that even like sleeping with this person, you might want to hold off on that because this person has an entity attachment and, um, and yeah, like you, you, yeah, and you don't you don't want to involve yourself with someone who has an entity attachment here, okay? But you have a lot of good things waiting for you in the future. This person is definitely a lesson, okay? But it's not the ending of your life, of your journey, of, of any of that. You have a lot of great things, okay, on the horizon, in the distance for you, okay? Uh, but for now, you're in this situation, okay? You're you're the situation is holding up. Uh, some things from coming through for you and that's okay because uh there are some things that you need to learn you also have a queen of cups here that is a huge gift for you okay huge reward somebody who's going to actually love you care about you nurture you not like this person here at all complete opposite here but you have a true love a true soulmate that is coming in for you here okay so you have a lot of great things to look forward to maybe even new uh more finances coming through for you okay because uh you need to learn something here there's a lesson for you to learn all right three of swords represents heartbreak uh something needs to end for new things to begin okay ace of pentacles here this is this is actually a gift okay um but you are going to overcome this challenge literally oh my gosh king of cups to the ace of cups to the page of cups and we just saw the queen of cups 
okay lots and lots of love lots and love for lots of love for you for you to experience here okay your your cup is going to be overflowing overflowing here okay you maybe even have a secret admirer right now so a woman who's in your environment in your energy who's wanting to start a new beginning with you who's looking at you like you are everything that she wants and more okay but you have to end things uh with the person that you're currently with right now in order to move on all right yeah that is being held on pause this this new beautiful soulmate literally this soulmate connection is, is on pause right now until you finish out um this situation here okay so so don't let this vibration okay this this uh this betrayal this ending here um you know stop you from feeling like there's no more joy to be had or there's no future or whatever because there definitely is a very 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 bright future ahead of you here i'm getting that you and this queen of cups are going to be collaborating here making more money okay that's why the ace of pentacles came out here okay three of pentacles to the ace of pentacles you guys are going to be working together to make lots and lots of money lots of stability here okay so don't focus too much yeah queen of pentacles she is very good with money very uh financially grounded stable loyal okay she's not greedy she's not money hungry very mature all right whereas this person is very childish the person that you're with right now is very childish thinking that all this shit could work all right sad um yeah i think honestly i'm gonna end it here my son is awake but i'm really glad that i asked this question i kind of wanted something a little bit more lighthearted, but it is what it is here okay um you know this ending is coming soon be aware this person doesn't does want to move on for the purpose of getting your money okay this person might actually love you the person that you're with currently might actually love you but they love money more and they're willing to stab you in the back for it they're willing to betray you for it so what you need to do is keep your boundaries like i said listen to your spirit guides keep your spirits up okay this is a challenge for you to overcome god is on your side everything is going to go perfectly okay the way that it should um, yeah, and I appreciate you so much. Much love. If you want uh, a more in-depth reading, please hit me up on my Instagram. You can DM me. My Instagram is in the description box below, okay? Please like, share, subscribe. Oh yeah, by the way, my readings, my personal readings are free of charge, okay? But I do um, have the right to refuse a reading with anyone or delay a reading until later time, depending on what spirit says, okay? I'm obedient to God first. Um, so yeah, until next time, y'all, I love you so much. Keep your spirits up and I will see you in the next video.